Alright, come help me with this. Just to lift it. Lift it. Okay then. <laughs> just a just Damn a bit Arthur. more. <laughs> Almost there. This way. See, si. then you pay more. Okay. More. Just a second. Pay more. Pay now. Dutch. What are you doing? Oh, Jesus. Easy, Dutch. You just murdered her. Who's that? Horrible old crone. But you killed her. She was gonna betray us, Arthur. Couldn't you tell? No. Well, I got some Spanish. She was. You keep killing folk, Dutch. I am just trying to make sure that some of us survive, Arthur. Now, shall we proceed? I guess. Listen, <clears throat> son. You think I want any of this? I don't know. Of course I don't. But I made a pledge to you all. We would survive. No matter what. So how did you know she was gonna betray us? What'd she say? It was in her eyes, in the way she was leading us. But you said you knew Spanish. I know human beings, Arthur. Mm. <laughs> Are you gonna strangle me next? I'm doing the best I can. Crazy thing is, why didn't he loot the old crone and get his gold back? I come from Mexico, I never... Well, I've stolen the horse and I'm heading back to Shady Bell. Some lovely music playing in the background here. I hope it's not copyright music. <laughs> I really do hope it's not copyrighted music. There's Sandini in the distance.
We're definitely going back to camp now. Albeit many people left out of the camp, really. Tilly, Molly, Mary Beth, Susan, Pearson, Reverend. Scattered into the wind by the looks of it. Anybody here? Hello? Anyone here? The watch. Susan! Strauss, you here? food Hello Shady Pearson Letter. Dear, Dear Uncle, Uncle Tacitus, I do so hope you enjoyed your vacation. Lucky you, leaving like that. And you always suggested you were too old for travel. I hope you and your cousins enjoyed yourselves. Me and your grandnieces have decided to take a trip of our own, as the place has become so dreary and godforsaken in your absence. We have gone to visit relatives. From my daddy's side, you are not yet acquainted with them, in La Caye, a small village just north of Saint-Denis. It's buggy and muggy, but apparently neither is too bad at this time of year. Please, come see us when you can. Yours sincerely, Caroline. Well, thank you, darling niece Caroline. I guess I'm coming to see you in La Caye. Melton keeps sending us back every day to search this place. There quite clearly isn't a gang of outlaws held up here. Someone is here. Look, those are fresh footprints. Looks like someone might be here right now. Sure, someone is here. There's always someone everywhere. Well, let's look around then. See if we can find something for Mr. Milton. Mr. Milton? I'd like to find a poison snake for him. That's enough, Mr. Johns. You take Mr. Bunter and search around back. Mr. Worley, let's head inside. Gentlemen, be careful. I'm stuck on barrels. Let's go, girl. Yep. Go, go. Yeah. 
Yes. So Lark A then. So they went to the swamp after they left Shady Bell. Oh, that's clever. That's fairly clever. to my real horse. Rifles over there. And there's Pearson. Arthur, Arthur's here. Oh, Arthur, oh, you're alive. Just about. Something sad. Come on, it's raining. <laughs> hey, everybody, look who's here. How y'all doing? Hey, old man, wake up. Hey, Arthur, they got John. Good to see you. Yeah, he got arrested. He ain't hung yet. Not yet. They moved him to Sisica. He's been working on a chain gang. Uh, howdy. <laughs> oh, look at this. Just the end job. Okay, okay. Hey! Hey! Uh, <laughs> How did you folks find each other? What happened? Can. Can somebody get me a cup of coffee or something? Yeah. Boss, Mrs. Adler, who saved us, Dutch? After the robbery in Saint Denis, she got us away from the camp before the Pinkertons turned up. Then Mrs. Adler and Mr. Smith drove away the degenerates of her living here. Mrs. Adler, we owe you. Yes. Yeah. 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 Thank you. It's been real hard, Dutch. We we've been surviving, but only just. What we gonna do? Things have been tough. There ain't no doubt about that. Trust me. I am gonna get us out of here. This ain't over. Ain't none of you folks interested in our adventures? Mm. Guess we're more <laughs> interested in escaping the hangmen on our tail? Cheerful nymph of the prairie, wasn't you, Abigail? Oh, sure. My fair heart jumps for joy when I set eyes on you, Micah. <laughs> We buried Hosea Dutch. Charles and I stole his body from the law one night and gave him a proper burial. It was real nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, here you is. Well, I asked everyone I could find, and eventually someone new said you fools were out here. Shit. Give me a drink or something. Get your own damn drink. In our absence, Mrs. Adler here has been looking after things. Now sit down. This is Agent Milton with the Pinkerton Detective Agency. Already? On behalf oh, of shit. Cornwall, Kerosene, and Tor, the United States Government, and the Commonwealth of West Elizabeth. Here we go. We are here to arrest you. Come out with your hands up. Give them to a count of five, then give them everything. Actually, let them have it. it to everyone you could find, did you, Bill? Arthur, follow me. This is real bad. Just stay down, Ollie. We've got to get out of this. God damn it. Them. All right, 
like Mrs. Adler. Gatling gun. You saved us, Arthur. Oh, man. Bill and Sadie. <coughs> I'm bloody knackered by the looks of it. You okay, son? Sure. We ain't been back for more than a few days. What, what do we do, Dutch? Clearly, we need to leave. It'll take them some time to regroup. Mr. Pearson, Miss Grimshaw, start packing up. Javier, you and Bill, get out of here. Go scare off any scum still loitering about. We need a couple of days. Now, please, gentlemen. George. What next, Dutch? We just need some time. I just, I, I need some time. Now, we can't go east, because then we'll be in the ocean. So we're going to have to go north, I guess. I just need somebody to buy me some goddamn time, one of you. You'll figure it out, boss. You always do. What are you going to do about John, Dutch? John? He's in jail. Well, we'll get him. Abigail, just not not yet. There's talk of hanging him. It's not gonna come to that. Dutch! Not now, Miss I. Not now. I'm begging you to. They're gonna hang him and break my the boy's heart. Please do something. We will. Okay. I need all my guns, my proper I'm gonna guns. Figure out how we rescue this bastard. No. Yes now. Give me a Doyle's Tavern, a million avenue. Okay. There's all my cash. Got all my money my back. Lord, what a goddamn mess. Everything. Not sure what happens next. Whole thing has been hard on all of us. But most of all on Dutch. Who seems half crazed by all we gone through.
70% accuracy with the Gatling gun. Not a chance. Not a chance. Well, this is camp, apparently. Cigarette card? Flora of America card one. I don't know if I need that. She's freaking out. Morning. Morning, Jack. How are you doing, Jack? I'm scared, Uncle Arthur. All that shooting. Well, we're gonna move somewhere safe, okay? Okay. Guess I'll see you later then. Yeah, sure. <sighs> it's good to see you again, despite the circumstances. You too. But what do we do now? We need to move. Soon as possible. We've got a couple of days. Okay. Guess I'll leave you to it then. Uh-huh. Yeah, Arthur. Good to see you again, Karen. Where's Molly, by the way? Nobody's seen her in ages. Good riddance, I say. Huh. Okay. Anyway, I'll leave you to it. Okay. Mr. Strauss? Hello. You keeping it together? Just keeps getting more difficult. Well, I know how you feel. I do. Miss Grimshaw. Some reunion, huh? Well, at least you're alive. So what now? We got a couple of days to work that out. Well, try to keep your head straight. All right. Miss Grimshaw? Hi, Susan. Oh, another morning. How are you doing? I've been better. Hopefully we still got a way out of this. 
as if it matters. Good to see you again, Mr. Strauss. But under what circumstances? Ah, uh, no. Well, don't give up on everything just yet. I suppose. There's your reverend. Reverend, it's good to see you again. You too. But this is a mess. A real mess. I uh, know. Right, I'm gonna go get my horse. And then, um... I think we're gonna go find Sadie. Just for the simple reason, I just don't trust John. Uh, there's my horse. And this is my new horse. Come on, girl. Maybe we sell this one. Move it. So what while we're passing? Ah, keeping the soap sellers in business with all that what here, huh? <laughs> so what'll it be today? Man's whiskers can make or break his whole deportment, you know. Now that isn't half bad, huh? That looks definitely more presentable. All right, you're ready to go. I definitely got um Thank you very much, friend. Good morning. Move right. already. Trying to Wall Street. 
country brought here to the south to help those wise enough to help themselves. Let me help you help yourselves. Crash, what that? Don't know if there's a guy selling newspapers, but be interesting to see what the news says. past the law office. Hello there. Where What's this one then? This is just a standard hall. Papers, huh? Well, I can't give you full price on account of that I'm might be stolen. It. Proper outfit on. What's your problem, huh? Who's this then? I didn't really have a problem. Man selling bottles of flower water. Good day. Newspaper for sale. Hey, Mister. I'm not a hater. I'm a racist. And I don't miss a thing, Sandy. Want a paper? Yes, I do. Take a pamphlet. See ya. Hello there. Buried, dead still unclaimed. Surish searching for Boodle. Please take a pamphlet. It might just change your well, more in a few weeks ago. Nineteen year old Lenny Summers and Hosea Matthews, believed to be approximately fifty five, were reportedly both killed. But the bodies were never found in the clean up, which took a number of days. of the island of Guam has caused the most intense of excitement on many of the islands of Spanish West Indies. He's a kind and effective leader. of mine Go on now. Read one of my pamphlets. 
Otis Miller. Explain the exact difference between the races using real science. I'm not a hater, I'm a racist, and I want you to be the same. There we are. So we've learned then. Lenny was only Hello, 19? Mister. He seemed a lot what? older than that. Hello there. You alright, boy? Mister? Right, we're going to try and find Mrs. Adler. I don't think there's anything else for me to do. Uh, there's no... Um, side missions that I can see anywhere. This point in time. We just go get Sadie. Hi there, mister. Hi there. Hey, mister. Hello, sir. Actually, forget it. Had enough of my attention. Hey there, partner. How do you do? Hello, sir. Howdy. Hey there. Hey, partner. Hello. Hello. Okay. Hello there. Sir. Howdy. Hey. That's not good. Am I being robbed? Mister, are you okay? Mister, are you okay? Are you okay, mister? <laughs> mister, you, you don't look so good. Let's get you to a doctor. Okay. Come on, it's not far. Just it's been a rough here. couple of weeks. Maybe I'm just cracking <laughs> under the strain of things. <laughs> Give me a minute. Give me a minute. <laughs> that don't look good, I'll be though, fine. does it? Oh no. It's all forgot the Rona. Arthur managed to catch Rona. Now you head in there, friend. Go on. Can I help you? Uh, I, I need a doctor. Oh, uh, just one second, sir. Come in, pal. Come in. I need some help. And so it seems. 
And that's Dr. Mister to you. Dr. Mister. <laughs> Doc I'm Dr. Mister. I was joking. Look, friend, I don't mean nothing, but you got money? I mean, before I start treating you, because I got a family. Yeah, I understand. Here, let do you. Uh, sure. Thank you. Now, what's wrong? I mean, what appear to be the symptoms? Well, I think you've heard them and I'm coughing. Uh, is there any blood? Sometimes. Uh-huh. Okay, now here. Breathe. The canal don't look very healthy. Again? Yeah. Let me see your tongue. Now say ah. Ah. What is it? It's not good news. Well, I guess that. You got tuberculosis. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. Oh, what do you mean? You're real sick. You. It's a progressive disease. And you'll be. Now, the best thing is rest and getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now, is that possible? Sure, I can just take my winters in my country club in California. No, it's not possible. Well, like I said, I, I'm real sorry. Yeah, well. Yeah, oh, wait, wait. Uh, let me get you a little bit more energy today. Tuberculosis. 